hello good morning and welcome to this video in this video i'll be showing you how to create a collection and how to mint an nft on OpenSea. so first up this is my web3 base wallet trust wallet and i'll be using the dApp section so click on dApps, click on here and i open the OpenSea platform So this is the OpenSea platform for new individuals who will be accessing this platform for the first time. They will be receiving a prompt in order to connect the platform to their wallets. I've connected, I've connected my wallet to the platform previously, so I don't receive that prompt. So first up, come here and click on account, which is my profile. To get to see the name is I own in my wallet, currently shown here on OpenSea. And this is my name. Then next up, I click on create. To create my collection so in order for you to meet nfts on OpenSea, you are required to create a collection which is where you would upload your digital creations and you sell your nfts to all your fans so I click on create and i click on logo so i go to my media library to look for an artwork So here is my logo, my pretty name for the collection. And I give it a description. I click on create and in a few seconds my collection will be created so my collection has been created so the next step I click on add items so in order to means after you created your collection the next step is to add a new item adding a new item will require you to set in some to to, to create your NFT you click on add a new item so I click on add a new item and I sign the message so to create a new item on OpenSea, you are given a maximum size of 100 MB and these are the file types that are supported JPG, PNG, GIF, SVG, MPM, WBM, MP3, WAV, OGG, GLB, GLTF. You can mint image, video, audio, or 3D model. So first up, I click here to get my artwork. And I give it a name. And I give it a description. And I set some properties. Click on save setting level. And I add an unlockable content, which is a link to it. So 
So to get an unlockable content, I simply upload the image to my Google Drive. So first up, get to find my Google Drive. Click on, click on hard upload. And I go to my gallery. Then I find the image. And I copy the link for it. So that link is my unlockable content. I will enable the owner or the person who purchases NFT to get access to that link and use your ad swap for whatever they want to use it for later. Click on paste. And then I go through it again to ensure that your information I put in and correcting and then I click on create and the article has been created now in order to sell this NFT I will require I will require to sell I require to okay so I can decide to set to sell it at a set price or put it for the highest bid which is putting putting it on auction or bond it to that NFT to my wallet and sell so I'll put it as the set price and put a list price of 0 0.08. Then go to my price. I'm sure that I'm not setting, I'm not setting up a schedule and I click on post. So now for you to create the collection, you'll be required to pay this gas fee but since this is an explainer video i won't be creating this i won't be selling this nft for sale so i'll reject this sale and close it so right now this nft is here and is in my wallet but i would need to pay some gas fee in order to initialize this nft for sale thank you for watching and if you have any questions put it in the comment section and tell me what you like what you would like to learn about in the next video Thank you.